everyone, so today's video is going to be a beauty joint haul. I just recently got this stuff in the post yesterday so I thought that I would film a haul on it because I really like beauty joint and I have done um, one of the haul from them before and I actually got quite a few things this time. Um, one thing I just wanted to mention before I start the video is about the background. I know it's changed again for like the third time in a couple of months. Um, I do apologize if you don't like the background or you think it's a little bit too much. I'm currently living somewhere where the room is definitely not like filming appropriate. Um, so I needed something that kind of like related to this channel like fashion and stuff like that as the background because there just wasn't anywhere to film that would look good. Um, until I get a backdrop or whatever um, this is probably going to be what I'm filming with. But anyway, so let's just get started on with the stuff that I got. I picked up quite a few products that I've been wanting to get for ages, just seeing it like through YouTube and, and blogging and stuff like that. And then I just also picked up some stuff that I thought looked good. Um, so I'll start off with nail polishes first because they're right in front of me. I got two China Glaze nail polishes. Um, I've never bought any China Glaze nail polishes before, so I wanted to try them out. This one is um, in for Audrey, and I'm actually wearing this on my nails right now. It's just kind of like a minty blue color. Um, I think it's more like greeny and it's nice. I don't like love it, but I do like the formulation of these. Um, they're really, really nice and smooth. So I got for Audrey and then I also got um, Turned Up Turquoise, which is like a more greeny kind of, well yeah, turquoisey color. Um, I'm not like a huge fan of this one. It was more like, I don't know, it's more greeny than I thought it was, even though I did look up like swatches and like on the nails and stuff like this but I'm not too much of a fan of this one but um yeah I just got these two and that's the one that I'm wearing on my nails right now is for Audrey and then I picked up the elf liquid eyeliner in black um it just basically looks like this I'll show it on this side um but yeah I got this because um Shannon from Shenexo I'm pretty sure mentioned this in her like favorite um or beginner's guide like drugstore beauty products or something like this as her favorite liquid eyeliner. I'm pretty sure it was this one, um, but I just wanted to try it out. So I got that. Normally I use gel, but I just thought I'd pick it up and see whether it was great or not. Um, then I got the e.l.f. Wet Gloss Lash and Brow Gel Clear Mascara, which basically just looks like this. I'm really sorry about the lighting. It's like really rainy outside um, there. But um, yeah, I got this because I have seen this quite a lot for like just as a brow gel and stuff like that. The one that I'm using right now is from Ardell, but I don't really love it that much, so I just thought I'd try this out because I have heard quite a few things about this one. Um, next I got the NYX Matte Bronzer, which looks like this. It comes in a, a little package like this. And I got this because I like to bronze up my face before applying any contour or blush. And the one that I have right now is from Rimmel. It's the natural bronzer, but it's a bit too orangey for me, so I wanted to get something that wasn't too, wasn't so orangey. And this is in light, and it basically just looks like this. And then the bronzer inside is a really nice, like milky, um, chocolatey color. So I really like that. Then I got a brush. I'm kind of going all over the place, so I do apologize. I got the um, Elf stippling brush. I'll show you what it looks like out of the package. I have actually used this just because I really wanted to see how it goes. Um, I actually got this for blush, but I don't really like stippling brushes for blush, so then I tried it with foundation, and once again, stippling brushes for foundation, I just kind of find that it goes really streaky, but for powder, this looked really, really good because it has, like, those, you know, tiny little, like, hairs at the top, which just press your powder in and kind of, like, give you a more flawless, like, non-cakey look, so that's what the brush looks like there. Um, and yeah, it's really, really soft and it is more dense than the stippling brush that I have currently. So I picked that up. I'll go with eye things. No? Yeah. Um, I picked up a eye primer. This is the Jordana, um, eye primer eyeshadow base. It basically just looks like this. And then it's just like a, um, a neutral colored, um, eye primer. I just got this because I really... I don't use eye primers very much, but I, I think that I need one because a lot of the time my eyeshadow creases and I threw out the other one that I was using because it just didn't work. So I just thought that I'd pick this up. I have heard a lot about Jordana, so I thought I'd give that a go and it was relatively cheap as well. And I kind of like eye primers that um, are like creams and they're a bit more stickier than like liquids. I just think that they work a little better. So I got that. 
and then I picked up a mascara and this one is the Jordana um, Best Lash Extreme Volumizing Mascara and I got this because I've seen this quite a bit I think Lauren Beauty was talking about it in one of her recent um, videos but I thought that I picked that up because she really recommended it and then for cheeks I picked up the e.l.f. contouring blush and bronzing powder duo which basically looks like this I really like e.l.f. packaging it's really sleek and just nice so looks like that and then it basically just has a bronzer and um, a like peachy pink um, blush there so I got that for contouring and I really like the blush as well um, I wanted to get oops, I wanted to get the the sleek one but um, I don't think they sell sleek so I just got that and then next up I picked up another blush this is the Milani baked blush in luminoso number zero five um, I've heard so much about this so I just wanted to pick it up just basically because I see it around everywhere and if I can get it open I'll show you the color um, it comes with a little, little mirror which is cute and then it just basically looks like this it's just a really really pretty um, peachy kind of corally pink color so I got that. Then I got two, swim two, yeah, two e.l.f. blushes just from their blush range that I really liked. The first one is in Pink Passion, which is basically a, um, just a pink really, like a, a bright pink. I like my bright blushes. So I got that, and then I also got one in Fuchsia Fusion, which looks like this, and this is more of a, more purpley like fuchsia colour, if that makes any sense there. And I think this has little like gold shimmers in it, so I got those two blushes. Then I got the e.l.f. Eyebrow Kit, which I've heard tons about. This one's in medium, and I picked the right colour, I do believe, for my brows. Shadow there. Um, and then a gel kind of one there, which will be good for days that I'm just kind of in a rush, but I'm more or less likely going to use the powder because it looks like it'll really suit. Um, I have no idea where I'm up to now. Oh, yeah. Um, next off, I got the NYX blush in Natural, is it? Yeah. Natural. Um, once again, I just think I just saw this on a video from Shen XO. Um, it's just like a pinky, like natural colored blush, and I just thought it looked really pretty, so I got that. And then I got, staying on to face stuff before I move on to lips, I got the NYX Concealer in a Jar. Um, you've probably all seen this. I got it in light, I believe. Yeah, light. And it's just basically a, a cream concealer, um, which looks like that. I just really wanted to try this. I've heard so much about the NYX Concealer in a Jar, so I thought that I would pick that up for underneath my eyes and blemishes, depending on like what I prefer to use it for. Then I got three lip glosses from the NYX line. Um, the first one I got was in Doll Pink, which is basically just a really nice kind of like dark um, pink colour. I don't really know why I got this. I must have thought it looked really nice like when I seen swatches of it, but it's quite dark. And then I got two others, which I'm going to love. This one is in Mauve, and it's basically just like a mauve pink. And then I got um, Whipped, which is a really, really nice nude pink colour. And then I got two lipsticks. The first one is a matte lipstick from NYX, um, which look, comes in a package like that. And I got this in pale pink. There. And then the last one I got was a mineral lipstick from e.l.f. And this is in Natural Nymph. I've been wanting this for ages. It's a really, really pretty nude colour. And it isn't like a beigey nude, um, which is good. So it just basically looks like that. Really, really pretty um, nude. So that's everything I got from Beauty Joint. I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will talk to you very, very soon. See ya. <laughs>